is swinging baseball bats, setting off small explosives and countless moving violations. All problems New Braunfels police say they had to deal with this weekend. A group of streetcar racers believed to be from San Antonio shut down parts of an I-35 access road doing donuts and blocking traffic. Some of the dangerous action was caught on camera. Our Devin Clark shows us that action and tells us what police have to say to those involved. This video posted to YouTube appears to show illegal street racing in New Braunfels this past weekend. New Braunfels police say that it kept them busy until 2 a.m. Sunday morning. A car club from San Antonio had over 100 vehicles that were blocking several intersections, mostly along the Walnut Avenue. Reckless driving, speeding, blocking intersections and highways are just a few of the many traffic violations that New Braunfels Police Department spokesman David Ferguson says were committed, amongst a number of other serious offenses. Uh, some participants did also set off some very loud mortar style fireworks. Um, they were shining laser pointers at responding officers. They threw items or swung bats at officer vehicles and at least in one instance uh, sprayed pepper spray at an officer. Though the video posted to YouTube is somewhat grainy, Ferguson says the commotion led to about 100 911 calls. Police were eventually able to disperse the crowds and make two arrests. 19 year old Noel Bonilla was charged with possession of drug paraphernalia and 18 year old Michael Ernest Castro was charged with obstructing a highway passageway. Though both suspects posted bond and have since been released, tonight officials have this message for the New Braunfels community. New Braunfels residents need to rest assured that uh, their police department has plans in place to handle these types of incidents and any similar future incidents. And we're told that two vehicles were also impounded. And this evening, there is still a web of tire marks here in the street outside of the Circle K on 35 and Walnut. Police also tell us that there are additional arrests and charges pending. Reporting in New Braunfels, Devin Clark, KSAT 12 News.